So? Yeah. It wards off darkness. It's useful. Told ya. And so, how'd it go? The tour. I learned. The reason for my existence. Oh! Tell me more. All around the world, people live seemingly peaceful lives. They believe themselves to be moral and virtuous, but it's all an act. Darkness lurks in the pit of everyone's heart. Their light is a total farce. Sounds like your trip around the world opened your eyes, but you got a little bit more than you anticipated. You must have seen a lot of darkness. Those who are weak, and who desire greater power, simply strip the strong of their power and convince themselves they've earned it. That's how people become tainted by darkness. They believe what they want to believe, using hollow reasons as justification. They repeat this cycle, and their darkness grows. So you're saying the weak feel the need to justify their actions to maintain a sense of self. Can't let that slide? No. It's better they be ruled by darkness. People carry delusions of having power, but it's a lie. They are but sheep pretending to be wolves. Though I admit, I can understand why. Oh, I've never heard that one before. A Keyblade wielder willing to side with the darkness? Why not just let them be until the darkness consumes them? Because left alone, the world would fall to chaos. There needs to be order. You sure about that? Why not just sit back and watch it play out? Understanding hearts is difficult. More so the emotions within. I simply realize that it's easy to dismiss what you don't comprehend. All right, all right. The world needs you. I'll grant you that one. I don't know what I can do. But I will act. What comes next is too important. I suppose letting false light dictate the future might be a pretty lousy move. So? You can make a change. You have that power. What do you want for the world? Power, eh? Who knows? My training's coming to an end, and the exam's not far off. Maybe I can gain some clarity then. You're letting the exam decide? Listen to me. The results don't matter. You believe the world needs you. Sounds like you already know where you're headed. <sighs> it's funny. Somehow. I can sense where I'm supposed to go, and what I'm supposed to do. Yes. 
even this coat. There's something familiar about it. As if I meant to wear this. Hmm. No. You'll ditch it soon. What do you mean? I mean that one day you're going to outgrow it. How so? If you truly possess great power, the darkness can't control you. You won't need a silly old coat to stay safe. In fact, you'll be the one controlling the darkness instead. Me, on the other hand, I'm too much of a scaredy cat to ever take mine off. Who are you really? Some kind of fortune teller? Well, I could lie and tell you that's what I am when I'm actually a brilliant artist, or even a scholar. I could tell you that I dream of world peace when I'm actually planning for its destruction. The truth is what you see with your eyes, not what you hear. So, your name? What did I just... Never mind. I guess there's no harm. My name is... I'm a lost master. Lost... master? May your heart be your guiding key.
Wait, Xehanort! There is a reason the precepts bar us from such knowledge. Why do you seek the Keyblade? Would you blanket all the worlds in darkness? Reduce them to nothing? But darkness did cover the world once, in legend. We know so little about the Keyblade War. Only that it was just the beginning. Amidst that crisis, a precious light was found. It is a curious tale, and one worth exploring. They say ruin brings about creation. So what then would another Keyblade War bring? When the darkness falls, will we be found worthy of the precious light the legend speaks of? I must have these answers. The Keyblade needs to be forged, and with it the door to the Keyblade War unlocked. Fool, you would risk an apocalypse out of sheer curiosity? I will never allow it, Zayn. Not while I live! But once again, you have it all wrong, Erythus. Darkness is a beginning, you see, not an end. At birth, every one of us emerges from darkness into a world of light, do we not? Poetic excuses! If words won't dissuade you, only one thing will! The darkness taken you, Xehanort! Not your concern. Good game today. <laughs> I try. Maybe I won't go as far as you. Huh? When the world needs a defender, they'll pick you, Ericus. Huh? You you think? But that doesn't mean that I can't be there for you. Yeah, and I'll be there for you.
Please don't do this, Master! I'm not strong enough! No. It is because you're trying to hold it in. Let the dark impulses waken in the pit of your heart. Release them here and now. Sharpen your fear into rage. You must. If you do not let the storm within you run its course, it will wipe you from the face of the world. Make no mistake. Do it. Embrace the darkness. Produce for your master the key blade. Creature from Venter's Riven. To you, the name Venitas shall be given. Yes, Master. Who's there? my light. 
but my heart is fractured. And now, the little I have left is slipping away.
That boy, is he okay? I'll go see. I'm Tara. What's your name? Ventus. Whew. You can talk. Aqua, come here! <laughs> I'm Aqua. Terra. Aqua. So, are you here to train with us? Where are you from? Who is that man with you? You good with a keyblade? Uh, 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 Whoa! What's the matter? Are you okay? What did you do? Uh, Nothing. I, I just asked him some stuff. Ventus cannot tell you anything. Because he cannot remember anything. Huh?
Juventus, why won't you wake up? You're awake! Ventus! Oh, it's a miracle! Terra! Master Ericus! Ventus is awake! <laughs>